I'm Brian Way and I want to walk you through the process of how to hook up these DC weatherproof connectors. The first thing you want to do is strip about an inch and a quarter of sheathing off of the wire. And if you're going to be doing repetitive cuts, what you're going to want to do is just look at your pliers, pick a point on it, hold your finger right to it so you know every time when you go to strip it that's the point. And being very careful not to cut through the sheathing and into the insulation of the wire underneath. Then you're going to want to strip back about half an inch of insulation to expose the bare wire. Again, if it's repetitive, pick a point on your pliers, hold your fingernail to it, bring your pliers right to it, and strip it off. Make sure you twist the wires. Take your rubber insulators, push them over the wire, skinny part out. You have a male and a female plastic end that lock together. So with each male and female end, you have the metal prongs. So I have the two female prongs that'll go with the female plastic connector and the two male prongs that go with the plastic male connector. I'll start with the female. You simply take the wire, sit it in here, give the large prongs a little bit of a pinch. You're definitely gonna need the crimping tool for this. Then you're gonna take it and you're gonna crimp it. So once you crimp the metal connector around the copper wire, then you're gonna take the crimper and you're gonna crimp around the rubber seal with the larger part of the crimping tool. So once you have that completed, simply take the wire, and push it into the plastic connector. It'll click in. And then close the back end of the connector. It's that simple. The other wire is simply a rinse and repeat of the same thing you just did. Now that you have the wires clipped in, locked in tight, give it a test fit, make sure it works out. It's good. So there's your WeatherTight DC connector. For more tips and tricks, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.